Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Nabila. Ugh, I'm tired. All I ever wanted was to take a nap, but I can't sleep because there's so much running through my mind and it's like, this is the time the creativity flows and all I ever wanted is to sleep. Gosh, I want to sleep. I'm so tired. Look at these bags. Ugh. Today was exciting. Um, today's Friday, and today was actually my off day, but I was on the dean's list, well, the president's list, um, the honors list. So I went to school, and yeah, it was really great. It was really awesome. Um, in summer 2017, I was on the dean's list. We're already in winter quarter, but we celebrated... Um, the honors list for fall 17 today and yeah i was on the president's list so that means that my gpa is a 4.0 <laughs> i did not expect that because um my gpa for summer was 3.95 and when i wanted to check my fall grade it says 3.95 so i thought that either it was still showing the one for summer and it didn't update the fall uh, GPA or my GPA is the same as fall. But yeah, I guess I made a 4.0 man. So I'm happy. I'm really happy because it's, it's just a great accomplishment. You know, it's, it may sound like a little thing, but it's just really awesome, especially when there was a moment where I have not been able to go to school. There was a moment where people have told me, like, this is not for you. Just come back home uh, or go back home, you know. Um, or people have been telling me that I'm too timid or, you know, like my uh, portfolio wasn't, um, what you call that? I don't know. It was in Dutch and I, I just can't find a proper English description for it. But, you know, I just achieved so much in such a little time. And I can do nothing but give God glory, first of all. But really to be from the other side of the world and come in here and not be able to speak the language as fluent as you want to and struggle and stuff and then learning over time, you know, little by little, I improved and you know I can like literally be more fluent or whatever but when you struggle and you have to learn and um, kind of comprehend at the same time and uh, I don't know it was so much so much but for me to actually achieve while going through all the all those things and then you know outside of school you still have other things to deal with like you miss your family and you can't see them as much as you want to or um, you know even when you want to text or call you still have to do it at certain times because the time difference is so big you know it's six hours um, ahead in Amsterdam ahead of America so you know if I want to call my mom I would have to literally count you know, and I kind of calculate what time it is over there so that I could call her and make sure that I'm not calling her while she's at work, but, you know, when she's back home. And then I have to make sure I call her when she's at home before she goes to sleep, you know. So it's kind of rough, but at the same time, you know, it shows that I'm on the right track because clearly my academics are great. I'm succeeding. And, yeah. Praise God. Praise God for all that. I'm really happy. And yesterday I had a little date. <laughs> I had me a little date. I went to Bistro Nico. And it was awesome. It was like a French restaurant um, in Bucket. The food was really good. I had some kind of European fish um, with melted spinach underneath it. Spinach underneath it. And like potatoes with some uh, lime sauce, lime jus, you gotta be fancy, you know, 
it was really nice really fun i really loved it and i had some italian wine those of you who know me i'm not a wine drinker at all except for moscato that's the only wine i could really drink but this was something similar to moscato as except that it was not as sweet as moscato really is so it was cool had me some fun <laughs> yes so what else what else do i have to say Hmm. I don't know, my mind is like, it's like ideas and creativity and what not popping up in my mind and going and flowing and like, whew, there's a lot going on. Good things, good things, good things. They're all good, but I can't really place them yet, you know. I probably have to write them down so that my mind is like, kind of organized and some things I want to say but I can't say them yet because it's too early for me to say those things right now I'm in advanced pattern making and so um, my professor she's teaching us how to make a collection or like a garment from scratch and in the second part of this class she will teach us how to grade the patterns so if you have like a basic sleeve the pattern is um, a size 8 and let's say I want to make it to a size 2 or convert it to um, a size 16, you know. Then she would show us how to do those things. And then from then on, I'm able to basically make anything that I want to. Except for, um, what you call it, bridal, because that's a whole nother ball game. And um, we're going to make garments from knit fabrics because knit is stretchy and therefore you use different techniques to make those and i'm looking forward to that so i will have some knit and non-stretch fabrics in this collection definitely looking forward to it oh and about the restaurant oh my goodness there is stuff on the menu that be bold had no idea what those things were like you know like for example he was asking the recommendations on wine and this man came with this whole fancy spanchy um, description on the wine and we were like but <laughs> so he ended up going with the same that I had and also for um, the food he was talking about pork belly pita bread kind of chips and we were like okay and he was talking about different kinds of steak and he ended up going with one kind of steak and it was so good so good uh-uh.